Hello everybody, welcome back to another unboxing. Um, today we have two models. I was actually debating whether I should do this video because generally this past week wasn't the best and um, I was definitely not in the mood to make a video but I thought, you know what, maybe this will change my mood. So yeah, let's make this unboxing and let's take a look at some new wonderful NG models. So the first model we have is this NG Models American Airlines Boeing 767-200. So I wanted to get a American 767 for a while now, and since NG Model released this, I finally have this. Um, I was debating actually to get it. I mean, I wasn't debating; I was just like putting it off, and then I put it off so many times that I had to buy it from Easy Toys, which turned out to be more expensive. Um, because everywhere else it was sold out. Actually, only G DG Pilot had it, but theirs is gonna be, um, you know, coming in around like September time, and it was just not in time for this unboxing because the second model that we have, the American Airlines MD83 from also NG Models. This one actually came in a month ago because it was actually two days before i went to europe um, i decided not to unbox it i decided to keep it for until i come back and yeah i feel like now is the right time to unbox both of these so let's start off with this one here here it is and the ng models american md you know five years ago actually around this time i got my first ever gemini jets american md80 and here five years later i had my third one <laughs> yeah we'll have a close-up look a little bit later but for now it looks very nice so here is the american airlines md83 and wow these details are um so much um you know more superior than the gemini jets one for example these little front i don't know what they are these little front nose pieces the Gemini Jets version, they just had it like molded in. This one here, it's actually like inserted into the mold, which is very nice. Of course, this one has antennas while the Gemini Jets one did not. And um, I would say that the polishing, I would say it's actually the same um, than as the Gemini Jets one. It's not better, it's not worse. Um, underneath, we have the um, gray belly. The Gemini Jets one does not have this. Actually, you know what? I'll go get my Gemini Jets one so you can compare. We can compare it. All right. So as you can see, this is the Gemini Jets one, and it does not have the gray belly underneath. I am not sure if it's more correct. Um, if anyone could tell me that, that would be actually great. But uh, comparing them side by side, both of these look really nice. You know, here's the MD80. MD80 already by itself looks very nice, but the NG models just has that extra details, which makes it um, uh, first impression wise really nice. Uh, I'm not sure if the mold on the Gemini Jets one is more correct, but looking at it, the NG models one looks way better. Alrighty, up next here we have the 767. Um, the cool thing about this one, it is actually, as you can see, it is sealed in this like plastic here, how the old iPhones used to be. Um, I'm not sure if it's a good thing, if it's a bad thing, but it is actually pretty cool that you get a, mold, a model that, you know, it's sealed and it's brand new, but also, um, you don't know if there's anything broken on the inside, so I guess we will see that if it's broken today. There we go, it is not sealed anymore. That's actually satisfying, I'm not gonna lie. That's very nice. Wow. No, 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 no. Yeah. I, I, I felt like it. I felt that it was gonna be broken because it's sealed. I mean, let's see if, hold up, let's see if it's gonna be uh, as bad as I think it will, if there's paint chips or not. 
I actually putting it back in it's not bad as you can see there is no um, paint chipping so far which is very good that's uh, that's a good sign but this plane does look amazing in this beautiful chrome livery it also has the luxury liner details right there um yeah it's it's a beautiful aircraft well as you can see it looks really nice um this mold is um fantastic um there's no issues with the cockpit windows as i've seen on the 300s and there might be a little bit of a paint chip as you can see that's actually um I don't know, that's actually kind of really unfortunate. I was really excited for this one. But um, I guess, you know, what are you gonna do? Um, there seems, what the? Mm. I am actually kind of mad now. Uh, it does not look good, chat. That does not look good. Yeah. I don't know, I mean, look, I, I, I thought I was gonna be more excited, but with, coming, with it coming broken, yeah. That's um that's that's really unfortunate. So I can't I can't really um speak that positive about it because it did come broken. But um, yeah, it's still a wonderful aircraft. It just if it didn't come broken, it would been so much better. Well, so it seems to be that this um, NG models um, has turned into a little um, kit here. So basically, this wing was also very, very loose. Um, I decided just to pull it off so I can probably either re-glue it or I don't know, maybe I'll return it. I'll, I'll see what I'm gonna do. But um, yeah, this is actually, I don't know, it's just, it's just sad. Kind of ruined my mood again. Um, but yeah, that's it for this unboxing. I guess I hope you enjoyed it. But yeah, fly safe.